everybody and oh, welcome back. My name is Digi and today I'm going to show you all the new badges in another Friday Night Funk game. Alright, so hold your shoes everyone because this is going to get crazy. So our first one is going to be right over here. This is the um, Forgotten Crossover. This man almost did everything for the Christmas update besides something. <gasps> wow. Click on them. And there you go. Forgotten crossover now let's go ahead and add to get to some bad hunting our first legit one is gonna be the risk so we're, whoop, we're gonna go inside of the city run down this way down the sidewalk we're gonna go into the alleyway so if you don't remember where that is right over here go this way then go to our left oh hello edward eduardo jump down run over here and now they've added this spot right here. We can just run through. Thank goodness. Now, you see this Among Us trash can? Go to the right side of it and click on this door or hold down E. Once you've done that, you'll be teleported to this snowy wonderland. I forgot the name of it. Run forward to the tree in the very back where you will see a hand. Go ahead and click that hand. Where there's a bunch of skittle juice or ketchup and you'll get the risk next up is entity this will be over in the city once again we're gonna be going back into the city quite uh a many times head over to this the train or the bus stop step into it come on there we go and then go to mansion aka week two step on the black square here get teleported inside Go through the double doors, head up the stairs, go to your left, through this door. Then this is where it gets a little tricky. What you got to do is get up the bookshelf there, then onto this right here. Woo, jump onto the balcony, and then you might be able to zoom out and do this. Uh, let's see. All right, so yes, you can zoom out and click or climb up the bookshelf and then click up there. It's up to you. There is a bit of parkour, though, like I said. Next is cutie. Oh, thank you. I know I'm a cutie pie. Head inside the city. Go back to the bus station. Then we're going to teleport to the highway. Boom. Once we're at the highway, turn around and walk. Whoop. Ugh. There we go. Cross the plank. And then this should teleport you to another location. What? No! <laughs> ah! That's why you don't walk into the road. Alright, let's try that again. Walk across, step on this, hop off this, because this is a giant teleporter. Go to this car and click on the giant saw. So this one right here. Click on it, and there you go. Oh, look, the moon. Next up is Cyclops. It's here in the lobby. It's right, actually. Over here onto the stage through the logo through the red wall directly to your left you are going to find this go ahead and click on it and you will then get Cyclops okay next up is gonna be agony pack so might as well just keep going from here head outside to the bus station okay now you don't have to, have to use the bus stop if you want but it, it, it makes walking a little shorter. So I'm going to go ahead to the train station. Actually go into the train station. Go to your left. By the dumpster on the far right, there should be an invisible uh, ladder somewhere. Right There it is. Right there. Go all the way up. Go up this invisible ladder. Not really that invisible. And then go up the fire escape like so. There we go. Keep going to the top. Very, very top. Then, right over here, by the doofool. We all know who that is. Zoom out and click on the green and blue. Looks like an ice cream upside down. But go ahead and click on it. And that's how you get Agony Pack. Next is Annie. And actually, just stay up here and go to this spot right there. So, if you go from the spawn, exit the city, go down this street right over here in front of the theater stay on this side and hop on to this brick ledge whoops 
Uh oh, oh my gosh. Who knew this could be so hard? Then onto that, and then do this right there. It could be a little difficult. Whoops. There we go. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Hello. I haven't played Roblox in a while, okay? I've been busy with a wedding. My wedding. Okay, and then jump to this. Oh, oh. And then, oh my goodness. All right, there we go. And then up this ledge. And simply click on this. I, I think it's a, a water can. Or it has water in it. Click on that, and that's how you get Annie. All right, next is Mary. Go back to the city. Turn to your right, and I believe it's one of these spots. There it goes. It'll then teleport. So I think it's, oh, no, this one right there. What you got to do then is walk to this right corner um, white square. This is it. Step on that. Then do the obby. If you die here, you will then be sent back to the start of the obby. So do not worry. You do not have to worry about having to run all the way back. Boom. There we go. Ba ba booey. This obby is not super hard. It is quite easy. It's all left, left, left. <laughs> go past the altar. Jump onto this. And then jump here. And simply click on this yellow envelope. And that's how you get Mary. Next up is just a theory. Go over to main morphs right over here. And then go to extras. Turkey left. Go to the very back side and on the table over here is going to be this. Boom. Click on it and that's how you get just a theory. Next up is question mark, question mark, question mark, aka the Among Us badge. The Among Us badge will be over here in the alley. You may have seen the sussy trash can and if you went to click on it, then good job. You got the badge already. If not, then follow along with me right now. And we're about to get you the question mark badge, which is right over here. Click on it. And that's how you get question mark, aka sus. Next is government security unit. These are the ones you want to go to. Step on the orange platform. Head up the stairs. Go to your left. And you will then see a blue microphone underneath the table. That is how you get government security unit. Okay. Next, we're going to go ahead and just head back this way. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Bah, bah. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> All right. There we go. Next is alien. And we're going to go to the theater, which is outside the movie theater. So right here, go into the city like so. And again, we're getting the alien badge. Boom. Go to the entrance. Hop on the main stage. Go to the backstage. And then there should be a vending machine behind it. Should be a alien gun right there. Boom. Click on it. And that's how you get alien. Next is the church. Over here in spawn, step on this platform. Walk forward down the aisle like I did for my wedding. And then click on the cross right here behind the speakers. Oh, gosh, that scared me. And that's how you get the church. All right, next is Dave and Bambi. This is probably going to be the hardest. You do need all the badges in the game, except the limited time ones and the event. You need all the normal badges. I repeat, all normal badges. You do not need the event or the limited time badges. But if you got all the badges, awesome. Follow me now. So we're going to go into the city and go to our left. We're going to Witty's Alley. But if you don't know where that is, then follow me. Then go down this street here. And right there on our left is going to be the alleyway map area. Boom. Once we're here, go to our right. There should be a white platform. Step on it. And this is where it gets tricky. I suggest you hug the right side and jump until you see a pathway. I know it's super hard to see, but trust me, just hug the right side until you get the path. And then just jump across this area. Boom. And we should be golden. Once we're here, what we're looking for then is a thing of corn. And you can't miss it. You just keep running. 
until you see there it is the corn what you gotta do then is bump into it and get teleported here this is where you will need all of the badges and i mean there are a lot of badges so if you want go ahead watch all my videos on how to get them some of them might be outdated i'm not sure it's hard to keep up when they update these badges but all my videos should be up to date on these um badges again normal ones you don't need the limited time ones or the event badges okay because that wouldn't be fair you know if you miss that event oh darn so here we go touch the wheelchair to start the final challenge so go ahead bump into it it will then teleport us to i think it's called maze heck corn maze heck there we go now don't worry there's no jump scares here but if you touch the wrong phone you will die so you don't want that don't die dying's not fun in games all right so once you're here you're gonna be at the corn maze of heck and I know it's dark here, so hopefully me raising the exposure in the video helps. If not, it's really easy. Just make sure you follow along. So go up the stairs. Then what we got to do is go to our right and then go to our left. Okay. Now, the thing you got to be aware of is there are phones placed around the corn maze, but they are wrong. Don't touch them. They will oof you if you touch them. And then you guys start over at the end or at the beginning of the maze. So right here is a dead end. So we're going to go to the right side like so. We're going to go past this left turn. Then once we're here, just follow the pathway and continue on. But um, yeah, there are phones hidden around here that will oof you. So don't touch them. And uh, again, this maze is not really that hard. You just got to make sure you follow along carefully. There's not a lot of turns, but you can get lost if you miss the correct turn. Because as you can see, we can't sprint. So that's no bueno. Right here, what we're going to do is we're going to go left all the way. Here we go. And then go to our right. Okay, we're just going to scoot over this way and follow the pathway. I believe the next parts are all right turns, if I remember correctly. So right here, we're going to go to our right. And then there should be one more right turn, if I'm correct. And then we should find a set of stairs going down. And that is when you know you have gotten to the end. Here we go. I believe, yes, I think we're on the right track because I remember seeing the orange red glow. And then we should be presented with either a left or a right. I cannot remember. Let's see. We I know we're getting close to the end. Here we go. Is this it? Is this it? I believe this is it. Yeah, here we go. So we're gonna turn right at this green glowing area. And then we should be home free and go to the very end where we will then be introduced with a set of stairs. There we go. Head down the stairs and bum ba da bum ba 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 bum. Captain Phone reporting for duty, sir. Click on the phone and that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you get Dave and Bambi. But anyways, that is all for today. Thank you all so much for watching. There are just way too many morphs to go through all of them. So go ahead and check them out. There are 38, I believe, new morphs that are added. So have fun with all of them. Leave a like, subscribe down below, and join the Bad Hunting Squad today. Use star code Digi whenever you buy Robux or Premium. As always, stay awesome, stay cool, and good luck Bad Hunting. Bye-bye.